Are you looking for exclusive discounts off your next cruise holiday? If so, keep watching Planet Cruise Weekly. On this week's episode, we are taking you for a 10-night amazing Spain and Portugal cruise with P&O for just £489. That's £49 per person per night. And if that's not your bag, why not go with Norwegian Jade, all-inclusive for a seven-night cruise around the Eastern Mediterranean, or add on two nights in Venice for just £90 per person. And then there's more, because we're taking you down to Hong Kong, to Beijing, to the islands around Japan uh, for an incredible cruise with Royal Caribbean for two weeks for just over £1,200. It's truly mind-blowing. Don't go anywhere and keep watching. We've got to episode three. I'm back with the wonderful Glenn. You made it to episode three. We've made it to episode three. It's, it's an absolute result. And of course, you weren't here last week. Probably off on your holiday sunning yourself again, weren't you? No, I was doing other things last week. Yeah. I had a few things on last week, unfortunately. Yeah. I had a couple of days off. But uh, I'm back this week and uh, raring to go and uh, got some great deals. What were you doing, Gordon? Be honest. Uh, I was having some time off with the family. Oh, yeah. that's nice. See the little He's a family man. He's a dad. Exactly, Can you yeah. believe it? He's a dad. Can you believe it? I know. I never thought that would happen a few years ago. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much for all your comments. Thank you so much for sharing and for subscribing and for liking. If you do this week, for every like, um, for every uh, comment, and for every time you subscribe or encourage a friend to subscribe, we will give a pound to Sports Relief. That's good, isn't it? It's Sports Relief. A little bit of charity work as well. And we're trying work. to get the bosses to top it up as well. At the we're going to try and so yeah. we'll announce on next week's show how much that you have helped us raise for Sports Relief. So once again, uh, like it, uh, comment on it, and you, know, you can share it, you can do whatever you want. Just get involved and we will give a pound for every involvement you give us. Uh, remember, for any of the three deals we're going to feature on today's show, if you do give us a ring, and we encourage you to do so straight away, uh, quote YouTube 25, you get an extra 25 pounds off any of the prices that we show today. So let's, uh, let's move on to deal number one. This is a 10-night Spain, Portugal and Gibraltar cruise from Southampton. It is with the legendary P and O Ventura. It's heading out on the 23rd of November 2016. It is just, drum roll, 49 pounds per person per night. Now you cannot get a decent hotel in the UK. If you think for that. if you think a normal hotel in England, even some of the like, you know the more basic hotels, and this is getting all the this entertainment, the food, and everything. I was in a hotel room. last night, 55 pounds. I didn't get any food, didn't get any entertainment. I got a bit of a lumpy bed and some grouchy service. This is 49 pounds per person per night with your food, with your entertainment, everything. With beautiful view, everything. And a good day. ship as well. Great ship. Venture. And a great yeah. ship. Um, and guess what? The prices are incredible because. Inside cabins, 489 for 10 nights. Upgrade for about 50 quid for the outside. Or if you want to treat yourself, you can even go to the balcony cabin at 679. Now also we do get feedback. Some of our clients want single prices. They're traveling by themselves. Absolutely. We can't always accommodate it on every single cruise. This one we can. 789 for a 10 night cruise on Ventura for the single travelers. So that's a great offer for you guys as well. And when we say we can't accommodate it, we are determined by what the cruise lines offer us. Exactly. So, you know, we are trying to encourage them to give us more solo cruising prices. Really, really important. Great prices there. Okay, let's have a look at the itinerary. So you're heading out from Southampton. No worries there on your luggage. You've got a day at sea to relax and enjoy everything uh, that P&O give you. It's a beautiful beautiful ship, uh, quite large, quite spacious. Yeah, I mean, it's one of their biggest ships, but it's very, very grounded now. It's been running now for about eight or nine years. Very, very well established, and the crew on there are very good. Uh, your first port is going to be La Coruña in Spain. Fantastic opportunity to walk the Pasamo Maritimo, 10 kilometers, get the fresh air, go maybe to Zara. That's where Zara was born, so great for shopping. Another sea day, and then we hit uh, Seville. The actual port is Cadiz, and it's a great opportunity just to explore kind of the heart of Andalusia, and then head into the orange blossomed area. Beautiful part of the world as well. Always good weather down there as well. Always so good weather, yes. Yeah. So you're topping up your tan. And then the next day, we're through into Malaga, the birthplace of Picasso. Beautiful place, a uh, beautiful part of the world, down into southern Spain. Again, one of my favourite places to go and visit from Malaga, even if you just don't go around the port area, which is stunning anyway, go up into the village, up into Mijas. Beautiful old village there, again, like stepping back into time. Okay, and then the next day, you are in Gibraltar. Now, this is obviously uh, part English, part Spanish. You've got the British telephone boxes, the British policemen there as well. You can walk down there, good for shopping as well, or make a, a walk up to the rock and uh, go and see the monkeys. Go and see those cheeky Barbary apes, go to Cathedral Cave. Uh, then we came from Gibraltar through to Lisbon. Uh, Lisbon, of course, the capital of Portugal, uh, sailing down the Tacos River. Incredible opportunity for you to try some custard tarts and some of the old trams. 
two days at sea back to Southampton. Um, it's an incredible itinerary. And again, this is starting from just 489 pounds for 10 days. It, 23rd of November, 2016. So you've got a nice run in. Exactly, well. yeah. And the other thing as well, I mean, even if you want to upgrade to a balcony, you know, sometimes balcony prices can be quite excessive. This one's 679 for 10 nights and it's lovely. Imagine standing out on the balcony coming into Lisbon or down in Southern Spain as well. Great chance just to relax. And it's a really, easy. really good price. And of course, remember as well, because it's selling out of Southampton, we can give you the Mion Valley Marriott top up as well, which means for just 89 pounds per person, you get an extra night in your hotel, which gives, means your holiday starts the night early. You get 10 days free car parking and a private taxi transfer to the port and then pick up back to the hotel in your car to drive home. It's the best way to possibly start your cruise. So get in touch with us now. If you want any more information, hit that button there. Uh, don't forget, again, comment. Let us know what you think about this cruise and the ports you're going to. And remember, every comment gets a pound for sports relief this week. Um, thank you very much. Don't go anywhere because coming up after this, we have a fantastic cruise too. Down to the Easter Med on Norwegian Jade. Now, Glenn, are you smiling? I'm always smiling. Smile. I'm always smile. smiling. You have to smile more. <laughs> important, isn't it? You have to smile. Got lots of, got lots of Do you smile with your teeth or not? Oh, well, I've got to smile with my teeth. They come with my mouth. But always helpful, isn't well, it? I don't know what else to do. <laughs> <laughs> right, OK. Um, the next cruise, cruise number two, is an eight-night Venice, Greek Isles and Croatia cruise. It goes out on the 8th of October this year, 2016. And uh, it's an incredible opportunity to go out with Norwegian cruise lines. Now, you get free all-inclusive and $50 spend, and for people of Ocean View and above, you also get uh, free Wi-Fi. And this is with London flights, but there are Manchester flights available. Yeah, we can do Manchester flights if you wanted to. There mm. is a supplement on there for you, but again, if you want to do Manchester flights, we can do them in and out, in and out but it's really Which is great. And the prices are starting from? An inside cabin at 699, the Ocean View at 889, or you can treat yourself for a balcony at 989 per person. The other thing you can do on here, you can also upgrade as well for an extra 89 pounds per person and give yourself an extra two nights in, the, uh, in Venice. Nice. It's, it's fantastic, it's really fantastic. It's a beautiful, beautiful city. A city of romance, which is why Glenn's out there quite regularly. Exactly. Yeah. There we go. So Not 8th with of October. anybody, just by myself. But, just on his own. Yeah. <laughs> just trolling Romantic you. 8th of October 2016 <laughs> is where this is going out. And again, Norwegian Cruise Lines. Now, it's a cracking itinerary. Um, but before we talk about that, let's talk about Norwegian Cruise Lines because this is freestyle cruising. It's very laid back, it's very informal. Yeah, it, again, it's every ship is different, as you know, and every sort of company is different. Norwegian's great for those people that just want to relax, they don't want to have set dining, they don't want to wear the dicky bow every single night. Loads of activities, loads of bars and restaurants, great entertainment on board as well. So again, freestyle dining. And the big thing with this as well, the all-inclusive package, if you bought it yourself on board, it's $49 per person plus VAT. This is included in the price that we're doing for you. So work out that inside price, what you get for that is amazing. Very, very good really value. Good. Okay, so all-inclusive cruising, which means when you head out from Venice, an amazing sail out, of course, sailing past St. Mark's, the Campanile, going along what well, those James Bond boat, boats kind of racing up past you, kind of jaws resting in the back. Um, really, really great start to your cruise. You've got a day at sea heading down the Adriatic before you arrive in Corfu. Beautiful, big uh, Mediterranean island. Um, of course, it's where Shakespeare set the Tempest. And then you head round and into uh, the Greek islands, Santorini, one of the Cyclades group, and it's beautiful. Well, they reckon Santorini is in the top five sailings of the world. Mm, if you've I never been that. there before, it is absolutely beautiful. You will tender off Santorini in the caldera. You'll see the actual area of Sa Santorini itself. Make your way up into Fira, and that's the main town there, or the main other place is Oya, which is where the Blue Dome buildings are. Mm. And again, with this one, to get up and down the cliff face, uh, best to use the cable car. They have donkeys there. We don't advise that you go uh, down on the donkeys. No, on the way back down, particularly when they're getting fed, so they go really, They really go really, really fast. So just stick with the cable car up and down. There might be a little bit of queues there, but again, the views in some of the bars when you're sitting having a drink there is amazing. Okay, then you're going through to Mykonos, another beautiful picturesque island, great for a beach day, great just to wander around Shora, which was built to confuse pirates since where little uh, Shirley Valentine was filmed in Little Venice. Then you're through into Athens. The port is Piraeus, of course, but it's a very quick trip through into Athens. Great opportunity to explore that historic city centre and try Greek salads and stare up at the Parthenon. And then a day at sea. Remember, on my days at sea, 
all the tricks are going because it's an all, all included upgrade. Brilliant. And then you're hitting split in Croatia. Now, Croatia's stunning. really taken off over the last 10 years. Dubrovnik obviously was one of the main destinations, and obviously they've opened up Korčula and they've split as well. Amazing chance to go into the old town there, the cobbled streets, the walled village there the as well. Palace. Beautiful, Beautiful chance. Yeah. And as I said, split's not as busy as Dubrovnik, so it's a little bit easier to get around there, but still stunning. And it's a nice time of year to go in October because it's not going to be quite as busy, so you get great opportunities to have a look around. You've got a very long water, water promenade called the Reaver as well, with loads of great cafes where you can just wander down and people watch. Okay, and then from Split in Croatia, we then sail across back up the Adriatic into Venice before you have to head back to the UK. So again, 8th of October 2016, that is all inclusive with Norwegian cruise lines. Uh, great sunshine, even at that time of year, it really, really is. London flights, Manchester are available. Manchester are available, but I really would strongly suggest for £90 extra upgrade and give yourself two nights in Venice as well. Yeah. All inclusive, All it's got to be done. Brilliant, love it. Okay, um, don't go anywhere because coming up, uh, the next deal is going to be an amazing chance to go to Beijing and Hong Kong. But before we get there, let's say hello and thank you to some of the people that have been getting in touch. And remember, if you get in touch this week, it's a pound to Sports Relief for every like, every share, every comment, every subscribe. Um, however, these people said lovely things last week. Thanks for that. Um, we've got Catherine and also Steve Harters, both saying how much they enjoyed last week's show. Thank you very much for that. And Matty as well, saying that he's looking for something for next year. So we're getting we're working on that, Matty. We're going to hopefully next week bring you something for uh, maybe 2017 and he's beyond. He's planning well in advance. He is. Apparently no, he's already good. booked his cruise with us for this year. Oh, so uh, thanks for getting in touch, Matty. But remember, every way you subscribe or you share or you like, this, this week means a pound to support. So you could say that we have saved the best till last. This is an incredible opportunity. And don't forget, as with all the deals featured on this show, YouTube 25 is what you quote when you ring up, and that gives you an extra 25 pounds off the price listed as we speak. This one though is incredible because it's, uh, it's Royal Caribbean's Legend of the Seas. It's going out on the 5th of May 2016, so you don't have long to wait, you've got about five or six weeks to really uh, get excited. And it's where it's going, it's heading out to Hong Kong, to Beijing, to the islands around Japan for an incredible price. Bearing in mind it's giving you a chance with the Great Wall of China. When you think about the price, because we've got prices starting from... Well the ocean views are coming in at 12.79, and remember that includes the flights as well. Sometimes people think, well that, does that include the flights? Yes it does. Upgrade the balcony to $13.99, or if you want to treat yourself, and the price for all this for a 14 night trip for a junior suite, including flights, everything we're going to have involved in this is $14.99 per person. It's an amazing value. That, that is amazing. 5th of May 2016. Uh, now this is with Royal Caribbean, uh, an iconic brand of course. They're actually becoming a destination in themselves and there's so much to explore on these ships. Legend is one of their older ships but still very, very popular. Great food, great entertainment, yep. great environment, multi-generational cruising and this is a stunning itinerary because you are flying out to Hong Kong. Um, you're going to transfer to your hotel, you get a two night stay and that's included in the price. So it's two night stay in Hong Kong, incredible opportunity um, to explore that massively cultural diverse city where shopping is king, we've got Victoria Peak, you see some amazing views from there, head out to the ladies market and again you can eat out uh, three times a day for 12 years and never eat at the same place twice. Exactly and the other thing with this one as well is because we're putting the package together for you, you can extend your stay so you might want to go three or four days, we just Absolutely. had the extra nights on accommodation so again the deal is even better. Okay, then after that two night included stay in a hotel in Hong Kong, you're then heading out on the ship and you're going out for a day at sea, enjoying everything the ship has to offer, all that great entertainment, all that great food. And then you're hitting your first port of call, which is Okinawa. This is the birthplace of karate. Now we were doing some karate moves earlier, we but we weren't sure about that, were we? Were, we? we were. Well, I'm, I'm going to do a little bit now because we, we were talking about our memories of, of Mr. Miyagi, weren't we? And kind of wax on, wax on. Wax on, karate kid and catching flies and things like that. I was going to catch flies, but yeah, you said, you no, said it never worked on that. But again, yeah. Okinawa. Was your first one to call on thanks very much that's the arm gone dead i've got another sea day to relax after that as well. you do and then you're in sasebo which is mainland japan fantastic opportunity there to explore the culture of japan maybe a catch a glimpse of a passing geisha and then you're over in juju island this is south korea very exciting this is um south korea's version of hawaii beautiful island it's a big honeymoon destination uh, for the south korean people as well so you you may well see some romance and some more future mummies and daddies we'll never, talk back to you, you and daddies never know, again, you we? never know <laughs> and then you've got another day at sea and then you're in beijing 
and it's here that you disembark and you get a three night stay. Which again, this is all included in that price. And what else is included, Glenn? Because we've got an acrobatic night show. You have, so it's not just a seven day cruise, your two day stay in Hong Kong. We've also got the add-ons at the end. So you're in yeah. Beijing, three nights stay there in a hotel. Again, you've got the acrobatic show to start off with, which is amazing. If you've never seen the Chinese acrobats, they I are- I train them all myself and they, they are, are absolutely second. superb. They bend every which way. They do, they're, it's incredible how they bend. Um, and then we've got the Great Wall of China. Yeah, um, which again is some people's bucket list. They want to tick that off. You've never been there before. So it's you get a, tour, a chance to actually go on the wall. It's included in the price to the Great Wall of China at Badling and also the Summer Palace, which is another iconic thing to do. Exactly. Yep. Yeah. And then from then, at the end of that, you've then got your flights back to the UK with your uh, flights back from Beijing, all included in the price. So you've got two nights in Hong Kong, seven-day cruise. You've got all that included in Beijing as well. Again. Ocean View 1279, but if you want to treat yourself, one upgrade to 14.99 for the junior suite. The other thing you need to be aware of, visas for China as well. You've still got time to do that. It takes a couple of weeks to get your visa. This is going in about five weeks. So if you're thinking about doing this, you need to act on it now. Get those visas sorted, you'll need those for when But you're this has been selling like hotcakes. It's only literally just come out and it's been so popular. So we would recommend if you want to get in at these prices, and as I say, uh, get, 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 your, get your visa nice and ordered early, then uh, call us straight away. Remember, quote YouTube 25 for an extra 25 pounds off the prices you're seeing on screen now. Uh, don't forget, comment, let us know what you think about these itineraries. If you want more information, uh, click up here and um, you know share this. Every time you share, like or comment, we're going to give this week a pound to Sports Relief. So you're helping us raise money for an amazing exactly. charity. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. And as I said, you know, we appreciate your comments. You know, this is a new show. As I said, we want to develop as well. So give us your comments. Constructive criticism is always accepted. And again, you know, we'll always look at changing the show Smile if we more. can. Smile, Smile more. Smile. More single prices. We will try and do as much as we can for you. Uh, and as I said, we'll get some good deals on there for you. Thanks very much for watching. We'll look forward to seeing you next week. And uh, yeah, happy cruising. <laughs>